Joe Biden announced his re-election last week for the 2024 presidential election. What do you make of that? Well, I think it's a shame. You know, I don't think he's qualified to be our president right now, to be honest with you. I've been calling for a while now for his uh, for him to leave, to resign, or to move on. I don't think he's cognitively fit to be our president. I think that he's got all kinds of issues. I don't know exactly what his issues are. I've, I've said all along, I'm not speaking as, you know, I am a physician. And by the way, a physician that took care of three presidents. I took care of President Bush, President Obama, and President Trump. So I'm really familiar with what it takes, both physically and cognitively, to do the job of commander-in-chief and head of state in the U.S. government. I, I've worked side-by-side side with him for, for, for decades. And uh, this, he doesn't have what it takes. I don't, I don't know what's going on, but he's got some issues related to his age, uh, some cognitive decline. Uh, he's confused most of the time. He doesn't know where he's at, what he's doing. He slurs his speech. He shuffles when he walks. Uh, he's just, uh, it doesn't inspire confidence in our, in our allies.